I'll be showing how an educator can easily file a support ticket directly with Microsoft support and we have education experts who can help you out. First off, I'm going to paste the URL that everyone here should write down and memorize and add to your favorites. It's aka.ms forward slash edu support and I'll hit enter. You'll be prompted to sign in, so you need to have a Microsoft Education Office 365 account or a personal account. I've already signed in. Here's our support page, and I'm going to walk through all the different aspects of this page. First off, I can choose a product. So everything from Hacking STEM, Immersive Reader, we have Forms, Teams, Whiteboard, OneNote, Class Notebooks, School Data Sync. We have everything. We also have the MIE Expert Program. So if you have questions about the program or your badges or MEC, the Microsoft Educator Center, you can file a ticket here. You can even file a ticket if you're a training partner. In this case, let's choose Teams as our example. Now, as soon as you choose a product, there's popular topics. So our top issues and bugs and errors are put right here so I could drill in. Oh, meeting recording says error uploading in stream. And this is an example, if I click this, it pops up the announcement. Oh, here's an issue that's happening and it pops it up right here. So it's really nice. Or I have an issue microphone not working during calls. This one will actually take me to the support page and I can understand what those problems are. So you give your issue a title and maybe in this case I say video not working. I can give a description. So always good to have a nice description. Give the details. What platform? Are you on desktop? Are you on Mac? Are you on the web? Are you on an iPad? You can also add attachments. So maybe you have a little video you've recorded of the bug or maybe there's a screenshot you want to attach. It's always helpful for our support folks to get a screenshot. You can even attach in this case logs. So Teams has logs. I can see how. Really nice examples here of how to get different logs. Maybe the support people will ask you, oh, I need this type of log or that type of log. So that's just what that means. And then you would submit your ticket. This ticket will be submitted to our education support agents and they are experts and they only focus on helping educators who are hitting any issues with Microsoft Education. They'll get back to you. There'll be an email. And there's a support site called HelpShip where they will be able to go back and forth and help you troubleshoot that issue. Now, there's a couple other really nice things on this site. I can't tell you how many times I get asked, hey, Mike, when is such and such feature rolling out? Or, hey, Mike, is this change happening to a product or service? Right here, there's a Microsoft 365 message center. And we put all the messages that are already going out to IT admins. We post those right here. So here's an example of a stream update. And I click this and I can learn all about the changes coming to Teams and Stream. And that's the message center post. And I can scroll down. Oh, introducing live transcription in Teams. Live transcriptions is going to be rolling out. And so these messages are posted right here in the support sites. All of that is right here in the message center. The last thing I'll show is there's a nice link to the support education site. I'll click this. This site is all text-based and image-based, but it's really nice with all of our support articles. So I can scroll down and learn about all the different things, Teams, OneNote, Class Notebook, learning tools. If I go into Teams to find some answers, we have really nice articles in here. So I can learn about what's new. I can go to getting started, learn about assignments. Maybe I want to drill in and learn about creating assignments. And there's step-by-step -step support and help. And this is all built right into our support center. And this URL is support.microsoft.com forward slash education. So that's a quick tour of how to file a support ticket as well as exploring our support site. If you found this video useful, give it a like. Now, if you want to keep up with all the latest quick tip videos that I'll keep releasing, subscribe to my channel and then just ring the bell so you get notified for all the new videos that post.